this one. Put it on top of my hand. Yay! <laughs> this one. Put it on top of my hand. Yay! <laughs> On top of my hand. Okay. No, that's cheating. That one. Put that on the top of my hand. Yay! <laughs> this one. You got it wrong. I haven't got it wrong. He desperately wanted to come and look at the excavators oh and the tractors working over there. So he's here. We walked all the way through the farm to come and look. And Eris came with. Well, Anastasia is busy cutting the next set of curtains that she's going to make for the dining room. So she's busy measuring them out. And I'll pop out and go and get some lining and some curtain headers. For her. And I've had this roll, I'm sure it must be about 15 years. And I knew one day I'm going to use it somewhere. And it's going to be here in the dining room. And I can't believe it that my daughter's making this for me. Thank you, Anastasia. This is so, so exciting. So she's finished the bar my bathroom's w curtains. She's finished my bedroom's curtains. She's finished the rose room's curtains. And she's made two blinds for the new bathroom that's being renovated. And she's just loving it. And I'm just so proud of her, of what she's doing for me. You might think that she's come to visit me just to make curtains. But Anastasia has got a degree in tailoring and sewing, in fashion design. design yeah. In fashion design. And she loves sewing and making things. Yeah, so I don't mind making curtains at all. That's wonderful, Stussy. Yeah. I was worried that you're thinking that you're just sewing all the time. Oh, no. <laughs> if I sew all the time, I'm happy. <laughs> so. so if everybody thinks I'm making a slave of it, no, <laughs> not at all. Um, she is really loving what she's doing. And I've waited so patiently for her to come and visit. Yeah. And I'm so grateful she's doing this for the chateau and for the family, you know. It's the family home. So it's my pleasure. Yeah. So why do you enjoy doing it, Anastasia? It's, it's just my thing. It's my passion. I like sewing. I like making things. Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> you're absolutely amazing. Thank you. And you're my daughter. Yeah. We're both amazing. <laughs> oh, look how gorgeous this looks. It is my grandson's little half birthday because I have never spent a time with him when he turned one nor two. So today he's two and a half exactly, and we are celebrating his birthday today. I am so excited. Thank you. And you did all this for little Leo. Yes. Yeah. How beautiful is this? 
Oh, I'm so excited. Anastasia has finished made the curtains, but she's now measuring up the lining on to go under, uh, to the at the back side of the curtains. And then she'll get that all stitched up and the curtain headings. Yeah. It's getting there close. Yeah. She's done both curtains. Here we are having a lovely dinner. We've made a tagine and we are here on the last night of our trip seeing my mum, which is really sad, but I hope that this dinner will be a nice treat. We've got about half an hour till we leave for the airport and Anastasia's just finishing putting the weights in the last curtain so that we can hang it back up again. Yeah. Oh my goodness, but you've done such an amazing job, my darling. I yeah. really appreciate it. She finished the curtains for here, but I need to get the connections of the poles and then we'll hang them up in the dining room. And I just have to hem them now. Well, they're all packed in. I'm taking them <laughs> to the airport now. My heart is absolutely breaking. But we've got to get on with our lives and move forward. Well, you are, you're all packed and ready to go. Yep. And you're off to the UK for two weeks and then you'll be flying to Singapore. We're going to miss you. I'm going to miss you terribly. But it's going to be fun. We'll, we'll be in contact with each other. As always. Going into the restaurant to have something to eat. They're sitting down. And then we'll order something to eat and then she can feel relaxed before she leaves. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog um, for this last week. It's just been a beautiful time which I also took off and I haven't filmed very much but I shared the little ones with you and the dinners we had and Anastasia was so busy with the curtains and I was trying to help with the kids and just getting to know them and bonding with them. Um, I think at the end of the day um, when they left yesterday little Leo started taking to me and it was just so wonderful and he wasn't scared of being in the chateau um, the last three four days he, he was just running around quite happy shouting and screaming down the corridors and now while I'm sitting here it feels so surreal as if they'd never been here and it's so quiet again I do miss them I must say having the noise of laughter and kitties running up and down and patter of feet. It was just so amazing. And to everybody that gave us such wonderful comments, thank you. I am so grateful for all your beautiful comments you've given me. Next week, I will show you the other curtains that have been done because I've got to continue cleaning the house now that they've been here and I want everything back to normal because um, little one was quite a run around and he had his hands on everything <laughs> and I had to let him because that's the only way he's going to learn um, and he was playing outside happily in the sand pits in, even in the rain it was just so amazing so I think I'm going to let you go now and I'm going to get on with giving that, getting this vlog onto YouTube now. And if you've enjoyed it, give us that like, subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, it would be greatly appreciated because it, the more people we have online, the, the more we can share and things will, uh, be, and you help me so that I can get filming equipment. There's also my Patreon account. It's in the description below. And if you want to be part of the Patreon account, I'll give you updates of other things that happen here in the Chateau um, that is more important. 
and um, and I share them with you and listen to what your advice is and try and follow what you tell me. And to the patrons that have contributed, I want to just gratefully thank you so, so much. This week, I haven't put anything on because I've just been busy with the children. Now that they've left, I can start sharing a little bit more on um, the Patreon account, as well as with everybody on YouTube. So I wish you a wonderful weekend coming up. And I'll catch you on the next vlog. Bye for now.